<laughs> well, hello, hello, my dear friends, my dear viewers, welcome back to the channel, and today we are back in Minecraft Harry Potter, we are back in the dungeon, we have our armor, we have our sword, and we have our fess in our heads, and we are ready to march into this unknown dungeon that somehow exists in the grounds of Hogwarts. Now we have our first obstacle here and a lot of more a door with skeletons on the other side. Ah, but the sword does do significant damage. That is cool. Oh! Ah, the sword does do significant damage, way more than I was expecting. Alright. Just some more loot. Oh. Alright. So, yeah, I mean, this is an interesting turn of events. Last episode, if you remember, we found this dungeon in the middle of the Forbidden Forest. But now, we are facing it. I'm sorry if I'm being quiet. I'm just trying to focus and trying to use the sword. I don't know if the sword was the best idea. Yeah, the sword was probably not the best idea. We are wizards after all, so... And if all else fails, we can also we can always hit him with the wand. <laughs> Whilst Bombarder Maxima recharges. <laughs> that is that is a super fun thing. I mean, if a spell fails, just hit them with the wand. <laughs> as if as if the wands would be strong enough to to even deal significant damage. Just as a melee weapon. Oh, I got a key. Cool. There, there has to be a locked door down down below. One that we cannot get in with just... Okay. More loot. Alright, this... This is a cool... This is a cool, a cool dungeon. I mean, it, it's a simple one so far. But it is cool. At least there's not a million of those copy and pasted all over the map, i.e. like a certain RPG game we all know about. Okay, so there's a Wingardium Leviosa pressure plate and there's a door. So I guess... Aha! Yes, I was correct. Now we use Wingardium Leviosa, we lift this, we place it there. And we get out. And we just select Bombarder Maxima again. Oh. Oh boy. Just. Eh. I love how they manage to animate the various pieces of the skeleton because this is something that I see could happen in within the the lore of Harry Potter within the rules. It reminds me of that scene in the first Pirates of the Caribbean movie where Governor Swan manages to, to... I mean, it's not him exactly, but there's that pirate going after him and he loses his arm and then he picks him up and he thinks the arm is not sentient anymore but the arm starts moving. It's just... Oh! Oh boy! Mert laps and rats. Mert laps and rats. Oh boy. Okay. <coughs> Boom. Double kill. All right. So, snake. Oh God. Be gone! Ow! Stop that! Alright, so... Ow! Okay... I'm 
just waiting for them to get in close range because the pixies you can't really do much with the pixies just wait for them to get in close range and just whack them whack them with your wand it does work if you're paying attention to them oh hello sir I see you were distracted there all right Alright, so skeleton arches. I don't know if there's anything there. I'm, gonna, I'm going to explore there first. Because there's, there appears to be a way up. So, I mean, I'm just gonna... Okay. The way up does seem to be a bit... <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Never mind. I'm gonna go up Geronimo! All right. Oh, there's loot there. Ah, I thought I was gonna fall. Oi! You lost an arm. And now you lost your legs and your whole body. So, so that's cool. All right. So we are on the ground floor. We have a statue. But I keep thinking there's something up there. I can't it's it, it's my it's my gamer senses they are tingling they are telling me there's something up there I'm probably gonna be proven wrong like so wrong but I gotta go and check it because you know it just I just feel a calling you know I feel a calling from there thereabouts so if I... Yeah, there we go. Spoke too soon, didn't I? Oh man, I thought I had... Oh no, I deactivated creative mode to run this dungeon, so... That's why I don't have it enabled now, so... We'll see. But the idea was there, and the idea was solid, so... I stand here, and then I stand here. Aha! Yes! And, of course, I am proven dead wrong. <laughs> As expected, but at least I took I took the opportunity and I confirmed my suspicions. There was, after all, nothing there. Ah, but there is here. Alright, coin a dunk ball and the skull can be worn as a hat. No thank you. No thank you. I appreciate the gesture, but what is that there? Oh, that there's something there. A hundred percent. But how can we get there? Ah. I thought I'd fallen. Oh god, now what? What is this? Is this interactable in any way? No, just a fancy piece of decoration. Okay, let's move forward. We shall continue deeper into the dungeon. Alright, it's getting darker, but it does get lighter. Oh, there they are. More spooky skeletons. Spooky scary skeletons. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a title. Because that's all this dungeon has. Ha! Ha! Ow! I thought I had dealt with you. But apparently a bombarder maxima to the face was not enough. You needed a good whack with my power stick. Alright. Not so much of a maze, but a complicated set of rocks is balancing here I gotta say I really love the design of this all right hello goodbye here take a hand all right so we have up and slightly down and up again so let's go up okay oh I think 
I think they both come out on the same place. Yeah, it's just two different paths for the same, yeah. Is there any loot I missed around here? Because there would be no point in having two paths if there wasn't any loot around. But I guess there isn't. So we move. Oh, 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 you sneaky bugger. Oh, where is. Aha, there is the dispenser. Oh, and there's more pressure plates here. Oh, I won't fall for these now. Aha. Now I'm paying attention. Now I'm being smart. Ah. Yeah, watch me next. Next five seconds do a stupid mistake like falling in a hole or something. Aha! But I safely pass to the Hall of Arrows. Ooh. Loot. Or possible loot. Alright. Ah. Oh, sorry. I, I keep pressing E because it's the interact button and I keep pressing it. Oh my. Oh. Okay, the enchanted skeleton. Why are... You are kinda dumb, aren't you? You just allow me to charge my spell so I can hit it, hit you in the face with it again. Alright, so we have multiple paths here. Well, not so multiple as in the way we cannot actually go here. So we have two paths. We have an Alohomora locked door and we have... Okay, this path... This path takes me to a... To a treasure. Alright. Armor helmet! Oh my god, yes! Yes, yes, yes. We gotta complete... We gotta complete the Luke. I'm sorry. We, we gotta complete the Luke. So... Let's see... Armor helmet, we ha... Sorry, we have to complete the look. Yeah... Let's... Oh yes! We are now complete, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sorry I took out the fez, but the helmet takes precedence. So proud. Mama Shrimp would be so proud of her son. A knight. A knight in shiny armor. Vanquishing worthy foes in a dungeon in Hogwarts. <laughs> None of that sentence makes sense. <laughs> but it's <laughs> so, so sad. Alright, enough of that. <laughs> Let's move forward. Or in this case, upward. Ah, so we are here now. Okay. I should probably switch to Bombarda Maxima. Because you know, oh no, no, ah, uh, not this, oh, not parkour. Uh, okay, I might as well just keep a little more in check, otherwise I'll have to keep changing. All right, bloody hell! Here we go, parkour, the bane. <laughs> and he starts laughing maniacally, you know it's going to oh <laughs> Ah there we go. Alright, now I can just jump down here. Alright Easy Well not so we oh boy Oh boy, there's more to this dungeon. Okay. Hmm. Aha! A puzzle. It's always the Slytherin. It almost feels like this was a Slytherin made a Slytherin made dungeon. As if Salazar himself built this dungeon to test his students. I wouldn't put it past him, like for all we know, Salazar Slytherin was a freaking Maniac. I mean, is there loot about? Is it worth it to go explore the waters down below? Nah, I guess not. If I see anything that catches my eye. Aha! 
All right. Arrows to probably tip us off balance. Ooh. Branching paths. Okay, so let me. Ha ha! Ha ha ha! Loot! Yeah! Nothing really that interesting, but loot nonetheless. And now we just hop our way across. I don't know if I can make this jump. Yeah, I couldn't make it. Okay, no matter. I'll just, just go back up again. We can luckily get up on the vines, so... Alright, so let's go back. Be mindful of the of the arrow. Okay, here we go. <laughs> here we go. Okay, can I? No, I can't. Okay. okay all right. Let's just. Oh, I meant to take out that mission objective there, but nah, just leave it. Leave it be. All right. I saw something there. Was it was it a visual glitch or something? I I'm not gonna lie, it looked like a ghost. It looked like I had seen a ghost there. Not gonna lie, I am a little bit concerned. Ooh, be mindful of the traps. Yeah, you can't hurt me. You can't touch this. All right. More parkour. All right. Ah, more pixies. Just what I wanted. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take a bearing of our surroundings, shall we? Alright, so... Ha! Get over here! Alright, so... Hmm... How do... Oh! Pixie loot! What? You thought you could escape me, did you? Alright, so where exactly should we start? Up here, perhaps? No, not quite. Hmm. Is there any... Hmm. Anything down there? I mean, I know I can't jump... I can't make this jump, can I? <laughs> of course I can't. But it was worth a shot. Ah! Well, did you look at that? Oh, no. Do not swim underwater. Please, if you'd be so kind. I know you're a shrimp, but there are limitations. Alright, so... Nothing here. Aha! Oh, my! Whoops! Ah! So now, I guess the water level just raised everywhere, did it? Well, it did, yes. Aha! Now I can go there. Ah! Mighty smart. Mighty smart indeed. Now I think what I need to do is go back down. Do I have an essence of gillyweed? I don't think I do. I never... Aha! I do have. I do have some. So, let's move them to the quick slot. Let's place it in this quick slot. Alright. Now we have Essence of Gillyweed here. So, consume one. Let's quickly maneuver ourselves through the dungeon. Alright. All right, this is cool. You have to go back and forth, surely, but... Yeah, now we can access... 
this place. Hmm. Ah, but we can now park over here and make our way across to the other side. Yeah. And there's probably another lever here, or maybe not. No, it's just just a way to this side. Okay. Cool. Cool nonetheless. Let's move forward. Ah, this this is a big dungeon. I don't know if I'm gonna finish. I meant I gonna be honest, I meant for this episode to be as, a bit smaller than than the usual, but I don't think I don't think that'll happen. I do not honestly think that'll happen. I mean we're 21 minutes in and the episode is already it's Oh god, I heard I heard the sound. Oh my god, there's spiders down there. There be spiders down there. You know what? I think I might as well just equip Stupefy because Although weaker, we do get more shots. For our mana, so and if we're fighting spiders, if we're fighting spiders, if we're fighting spiders, we need, we need speed. We need the higher DPS. So, stupefy it is. Bombard and Maxim is all well and good. Oh. Well, I guess this was a literal skeleton in the closet. Okay. Ah, hello there. Fancy meeting you here. Is this your first time here? I'm sorry, I just knocked over the mic. You might have heard the cut there. But yes, I, I was just fake patronizing with these spiders, you know, it's it's my first time around, you know. It's my first time around and it's been loving it's been lovely seeing you all seeing you guys all here. I mean it really is it it really has been an experience and a half. Let me tell you that. Wait, should I should I explore first this downstairs? Okay, larger spiders take two stupefies. And one small spider takes one stupefy. Okay, there seems to be nothing of value here. Oh, cobweb. Okay, we're out. Okay, yeah, there seems to be nothing of value here. Just a bit of spiders. Okay, no matter. We shall move forward with the dungeon. I would really love to finish this dungeon today, but I do not think... That will be possible, but we'll see. We march forward. My god, we keep... I see loot. My loot senses up. My loot. I found it. You stay back. Ah, wizard card. Nice. You look for your own loot to get. You've been here for god knows how long. Oh. Oh my, we're gonna need Veraverto soon. Just, just, okay, just now change to Veraverto. Do the last of the damage with the wand. And Veraverto. And kill the chicken, just for good measure. I'm gonna duel you like a sir, sir. This way I'll have Veraverto at the ready anytime I need. Havati, mate. Nope, I need. Yeah. Okay, just. I wanted to kill the duck. Yeah, there we go. Goodbye, duck. Alright, stairway. So. 
Oh. Oh. I guess we have arrived. What is this? Okay, this is the end of the dungeon. But there doesn't seem to be anything else here. No boss, no. Just a cup. And an uninteractable cup. Maybe I needed to have a mission to come here? Maybe. Oh well, that was a bit... I don't know, should I call it anticlimactic? Maybe I just missed something. Are we at the same place where we started? Oh, we are. Oh. Oh well. That was... I gotta say, that was surprising. But, uh... Yeah, I mean... <laughs> I did manage to stay under the 30 minute mark. So that is something. I mean... <laughs> am I right? But well, my dear friends, my dear viewers, this was it for the dungeon. It was... It was interesting, it was cool, it was a cool addition, and it was a small break from just exploring the castle. But do not fret, next episode we will be back to exploring the castle. Uh, but do not worry, I have two places I want to find, but I will try to find them off screen, and I'll try to start the episode next time next to one of them. I don't know which one I'll find first. But I will try to be next to one of them by next episode. So, I'll see you guys then. If you have enjoyed, please leave a like, a comment, and if you'd be so kind to go the extra mile, subscribe to the channel for more. And I will see you next time. Have a fantastic day. Bye-bye.